the chair of death. In 1702, a convicted murderer named Thomas Busby, was about to be hanged for his crimes. His last request was to have his final meal served, at his favorite pub, in Thirsk, England. He finished his meal, stood up, and said, May sudden death come to anyone, who dares sit in my chair. The chair remained in the pub for centuries, and patrons would often dare one another to sit in the cursed seat. Four people reportedly died shortly, after sitting in this 200-year-old chair of death, now it's in Philadelphia. The Haunted Mirror Myrtle's Plantation can be found on the outskirts of Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Down the years, this 200-year-old, 10-acre plantation has served as a family home, but these days it's run as a bed, and breakfast, and is a hotspot for paranormal tourists. Every night at 3 a.m. a total of 15 ghosts come out to play. Four of these ghosts come from one tragic tale, that of the Woodruff family, and a young slave named Chloe. The Possessed Bunk Beds The case of the haunted bunk beds were so famous. In February 1987, in Horicon, Wisconsin, Allen and Debbie Tallman brought home a bunk bed from a second-hand shop, and they put it down in the basement. In May later that year, the couple moved the beds upstairs. And nine months of hell ensued, and not just a bag back from shoddy bed building. From the very first night, the bunks were in their new room things quickly escalated, from wacky to just plain creepy, 